Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, RJ. Welcome back to my channel. It's Ruthie, Ruthie, Ruthie. Hello, how you doing? Okay, welcome back to my channel. Thank you for coming back. Um, as you can see, I already did my eyeshadow. I have on MAC. Do y'all remember those MAC products? MAC products and their eyeshadows. And then I use the Revlon Creamy Eyeshadow Palette that I bought years ago that I'm just trying out some of the things that were in my stash. So I'm trying to revisit these products, get rid of them or use them. Um, I also did my eyebrows already. So now we're gonna get into this tutorial. I'm gonna do the Fenty Beauty. Hey, did y'all go to the Sephora? Sephora has a 20% sale right now for Rouge. If you are a Rouge client, Sephora has 20% right now until November 11th. So do go to Sephora, save your coins, go buy the things that you wanted to buy, and buy the things that are expensive because you get the 20% off. You can always go back and purchase those small products um, or the small um, brushes or whatever it is. You can always go back and purchase those. Try to purchase those products that are expensive, um, whether it's perfume or whether it's an eyeshadow that you wanted to try, one of Natasha Denonia's or um, one of the foundations that you wanted to try that was expensive. Go and purchase purchase it now while you have the 20% Rouge sale today. It started yesterday. I believe that was November 1st and it goes on for, I think it ends November 11th if I'm not mistaken. So do go get your 20% if you're a Rouge customer. So if you're a Rouge customer, Rouge client, whatever you want to call it, go get your 20% is at Sephora's right now. So let's get into this video, which I did forget to purchase the Fenty Beauty Hydration Foundation. So I will be going to purchase that before the 11th. I did forget to pick that up. And Fenty Beauty also had a sale on their website. So I don't know if it's still going on. Do go back and try it and look and see. Um, research it for yourself. I don't know if it's still going on, but I do know that Sephora started yesterday and it ends November 11th, 20% for Rouge. Um, so what we're going to get into right now, I'm going to do Fenty Beauty Hydration Foundation. I haven't used that in a minute, so I'm going to use a sample that I picked up. I did pick up a sample from, from um, Sephora's when it first came out, and that's why I do want to purchase it. So I did pick up a, a sample, and I did pick up the shade 385, and I picked up the shade 420. So let's get it. So I'm going to start out by using Natasha Silk canvas primer and I'm going to apply that in my T-zone. Apply that in my T-zone where I get the most oil at. I'm oily. So I know people complain about people using their fingers but I'm going to use my fingers because that's what I do. And as you can see, I think I got good skin. Okay, now I'm going to use my L'Oreal Mercier setting powder. I'm just also going to apply that because I am oily combination. I do get a lot of oil in my T-zone, so I am going to try to keep the oil as back as possible. So I'm just going to take that on my Fenty Beauty sponge, Beauty, Beauty Blender, and I'm just going to apply that in my areas I get the most oil at. So like I stated, I used, I went to Sephora's previously and I did pick up um, Fenty Beauty in a shade. This is what I mean by a sample. Um, this is how come Sephora gives you a sample like this. And there's a lot of product in here that it lasts, believe me, it lasts. So I'm going to, this is in the shade 420 warm. So I'm just going to apply that with my finger and my hand on my finger on my face with my finger. And since we're using Fenty Beauty, I only feel that it's right to use her foundation brush in, the sh in 110. This is her foundation brush, number 110. Let's get it. 
I'm looking at you, but I'm looking at me. Now, do you see the coverage on that? I don't know if anyone is like me. If a brush is pretty, I don't like to dirty it up. <laughs> if the bristles are pretty, pink, white, I mean, come out, but. I'm gonna use the Fenty Beauty um, setting powder in the shade Hazelnut. And I'm gonna apply that with the Morphe E1 brush. I'm just gonna set my foundation. Okay, I'm gonna use the Fenty Pro Concealer in the shade 380. Honey, I don't know if you remember the mastic. I'm gonna just apply just a little bit on the bottom and on the sides. I'm gonna blend this out with my Sephora Beauty Blender. I'm looking at you, but I'm looking at myself. Let's get it. I mean, look at that. That looks really pretty already. You see that? Uh, that's her foundation with her concealer. Um, Fenty Beauty is ridiculous. Well, I'm gonna set my face with the Fenty Beauty um, setting powder. This is in the shade Banana. And why that's why the Fenty Beauty setting powder in the shade Banana, in the color Banana, is setting. I'm gonna use the Fenty Beauty Mastic, and this is in the color Espresso. And I'm gonna just carve out my cheeks and get rid of the five finger forehead. I'm gonna try to get three, three or two. And while we doing that, excuse me, Sephora 97 brush. I'm gonna use that, I'm gonna like a bronzer brush. Don't forget, I'm looking at you, but I'm looking at myself. Okay, let's get this in. Let's call this out. And you want to drag up the brush a little bit. You don't want it to, your cheeks to look like they're hanging. So your cheeks. Because that's where you want your cheeks to look like they popping. Okay. Are you checking that out on camera? Are you checking that out? Huh? Check this out. Huh? Check that contour. Use Fenty Beauty 170 setting powder brush to brush away my powder from underneath my eyes. Okay, another great contour palette. I'm gonna use the Contour Kit Tan Deep. Bronze and Powder by ABH. I'm going to apply this powder to set that. I'm going to take my Real Technique brush and I'm going to apply some MAC Raisin on my cheeks okay I'm, I'm gonna do the rest of my makeup offline and I'll be right back with the end result I'll be right back with the end result well I'm back and as you can see I did my rest of my makeup I completed it offline so the only thing I did was I smoked out my eye a little bit. Um, I applied a little bit, highlighted my tear duct. I put on the MAC Chestnut Lip Liner. 
I use ABH lip gloss in the shade Toffee. Um, I popped on a blue wig that was given to me by my heart. Very special person. Um, and that was it. So thank you for hanging out with me. Thank you for coming back. Thank you for spending time with me. Um, if you like this video, tutorial, review, whatever you would like to call it, subscribe, share, comment, hit the notification button, and thumbs up. Again, let's like this video, let's share it, let's comment, let's subscribe, and let's hit that notification button. Thank you. And as always, let's make it do what it do. Let's make it do what it do.